Hey guys, welcome. Today we are about to do one IP, one account. So I have a project here. I will configure it with Firebase. From one IP, one account, I mean user will not be able to create multiple accounts from same IP address. Let me add two edit texts for email and password and add a button for sign up. For authentication, we obviously needed auth component and to make a api call we need a request network component to get ip address of the user we will make a api call to api.ipify.org And to store data, we need DB component. Actually, we need two of them. One for storing user data and second for storing IP address. Here at onchild added event, we will add our map to a list map. and at on child change it also i will do the same actually i don't need to do at change it event but i am doing it so on response error i will show the toast error message and on response we will develop an algorithm repeat length of list map add a boolean set it false so if response is equal to we need a number variable here we will set it zero before a repeat and so we will check on each position of the list map with uh, our provided key in my case it is ip and if our condition matches we will set that boolean to true and below there if boolean is true we will not register the account okay let's pause here for a second and let me add a text view to show the error messages So in case our boolean was true, that means there was already a account with same IP address. We will show that error.
and if boolean is false that means that ip address was not registered before we will create a account on account created if there was an error we will show that error otherwise we will store user data and ip address in separate nodes in both db components we will use uid of the user as key so it will help us a lot in future oh sorry i forgot to increase the number by 1 our ip address is in response so we have to store it in a string so we can use it later I will create a second activity in that I will add a text view and a button and button will log out and redirect to the main activity okay so here on account successfully created we will send a intent to second activity now let's test if our app works oh so it is not working because here i have entered wrong url you have to enter full url including the protocol second thing you have to make api call using get method not post Okay now let's see if our app works hmm it created an account but when i retry it is not showing the error which i expected what could be the problem let's go to firebase and check out our rules okay it is false false that means we cannot read or that means we cannot read or write the data so let me define the rules for users i will only allow to edit on data and for ip address i will make it publicly read and writable so 
our app can read and write it without login because we have to see the IP address before creating account. Now it should work. Okay, now if I try to create multiple accounts using different email addresses I am not able to create them so our app is working fine as long as you do not delete that IP address from database. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you in next video. Till then, bye bye, take care, and Allah Hafiz.